Hello, Leo. It is time for your mid-August to September reading of this current year. How are y'all doing today? Good, I hope. This is going to be for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So check your charts, boys and girls. If it resonates with you, good deal. You know don't worry about it. It's just a card game. Doesn't, doesn't, doesn't work if you don't believe in it. Boop. Right? If you want a personal reading after this, my email, Facebook, and Instagram is in the description box below. Read, first reading is on the house, my treat. Everything else comes with a price, of course. And I take tips and donations. So thank you kindly. Anyway, let's get started with yours, Leo. You's running! You's taking off, and you hollering really loud as you take off, too. And the Tarzan yell. Um, the situation is the lover's reverse. What you want to do? Five of swords. Play some games? The obstacle and challenge, though, is leaving the world all fucky. Four of cups is the fear and rejection, wasting an opportunity. And the obstacle and challenge... Not the... Wait, no. This is what started this shit, and this is how it'll end. Full circle, right? You're at crossroads. Time to sacrifice something to hang the man. What will you yield? Four of Pentacles. It's a beginning theme. Someone's insecure about their money. Hmm. Cross watch or switch where you need to, accordingly. Right? Right. I like to say that before you really get started. Okay, so like... There might be a breakup here, and I feel like, Leo, some of y'all might be trying to finagle your way out of it without looking like the bad guy. I'm just calling it as I see it. You feel like it's time. You don't want to miss an opportunity. There's a good chance that this might end really fucked up, but you're ready to go. You just don't know where to go about yet. You haven't decided, or you haven't decided how you're going to travel or do this shit, right? Um, in order to stop giving the love, um, I, I, I think that you or the person you're dealing with knows that this is going to be a really immature move. But way more harsh because it's like teenage immaturity, not like child immaturity. At least child immaturity makes sense. The lovers reverse. Could be Gemini you're dealing with as well. There's a love scenario where somebody by splitting up. But I feel like they're being held hostage by people. Or maybe the person that they're with, which isn't the case, it's the hangman again, the total shadow side. Um, this person could escape at any time, they just haven't yet. Um, biting off more they could chew, going from temptations and lusts and such like that. Now, this person wants to play some games. Um, sticking her tongue out at what's happening over here. Uh, oh, Lord. Leo! Oh, my God! Like, what are you doing? You want to play games in the relationship that's, like, perfect? Cast your own candle and act like it's stronger than the sun? Is that really a good idea? I'm not sure, man. Like, that seems like it's... Like, either you're doing this or someone's doing this to you. And it's like... It's almost like self-sabotage or some shit. The world reverse. Ending everything fucky. Looking right at that hanged man. It's just like, should I end it the way it is right now to where it's chaotic? Or what should I do? Backstabs! Stabs all over. Come get some, you know, like you're like throwing that shit out there, you know. Acting like you'll be fruitful with your friend Buffalo Bill, but in truth, it's like things are rotting away around you. I'm sorry, this um, queer is kind of a douchebag. 
I hope this isn't you, Leo. I hope this isn't anybody, but this person's getting picked up. Uh, missed opportunity! Death! You know, everything just dies. Someone's afraid of that, I think. Or they're rejecting the idea of, like, missing this opportunity. Ignoring their intuition, just killing shit and ignoring what they already know. Or not listening to a high priestess or somebody who knows some shit, right? This person is completely insecure and running into a burning building with, like, someone's drunk aunt who looks like death. The hanged man. Crossroads, right? Ending the cycle all fucky. Once again, like... Trying to leave a loop or some shit. Jesus Christ, Leo. What in the world are you going on with y'all? Leaving it all funky because you think that they were it was all a waste of time? Damn, dude. That is crazy. This is like a really sad... Oh, heartbreak. It's like someone broke somebody's heart and then ran for their own securities. Like, what? Leo, I'm not happy with this. I don't like this person. I don't like this energy. It makes me like... Ugh. I don't like it. It's really harsh. Now, there's temperance right there. I don't fucking know what that... Like, what? Biting your time? With indecision? Not knowing what choice to make? When it comes to these secrets? <clears throat> I hope someone isn't doing this to you, Leo, because this is like a really downer reading, man. There's a magician reverse here. Who knows what the fuck he's up to? Oh yeah, he was already out here anyway. Was trying to make shit happen, being completely unfair. But still looking for like a reason to stick around. Um, not really going to say anything would rather wonder way cowardly than communicate. Is that what's going on here? Someone's ready to spring on somebody because, like, there's another money adventure? Damn, Leo. But you're gonna end up regretting it really bad. Because the other, like, okay, if you're, Leo, if you or someone else is in a scenario where, like, someone might be fucking hoeing around, because I feel like this is it, because, you know, heartbreak, and then running into a burning building with somebody else with a clock around their neck, letting you know that there's a limited amount of fucking time with this person, before this person, and after this person, you know, it's like, if this person leaves for the other person, they're going to regret it. And then they're going to realize they never should have started this shit to begin with. This is like a really, this is a warning, man. Like, whoever this is, if they take this action, it's going to be bad. And I feel like the person that they're not giving to, the one with red in their pocket, the one who I think has their favor, will find out about it. And it's going to be bad. Hmm. Leo, I don't know. But, uh, this is your reading. Wow, that is super happy. Okay. Anyway, if you want to like, share, or subscribe to this channel, go ahead and do so if you please. Jesus Christ. Down in the Shia. Yeah, so if you want to do any of that, that's up to you. No pressure, of course. 
Um, I love you guys' faces. I'm sorry this was just a crazy-ass reading. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.